Choosing what to do after school can be a daunting and difficult decision to make, especially when your options are being limited due to your grades, disadvantages or social background. Nevertheless, you deserve the same kind of opportunities as everybody else in society. And at Kenny Waste Management, equality and inclusion are at the heart of our apprenticeship programme. Whenever we take on a new apprentice, we want them to feel included, respected and supported in our workplace so they can then go on to confidently create a bright future for themselves that can either be within or outside of our organisation. And Shauna is a perfect example of this. Before joining us, she was a very nervous 16-year-old in her final year of secondary education who had a real uncertainty as to what she wanted to do next. This all changed, though, when we came into her high school and presented our scheme, which encouraged Shauna to come out of her comfort zone, submit an application, attend one of our open days, and then be interviewed by one of our directors. It was after school time, so it was probably like four o'clock. So when he arrived, I was really nervous. I made my dad wait outside in the car, I told him not to leave. And I come in, and there was Paul and my previous manager, Natalie. I hoped I provided the best answers possible. And then we went back to school, waiting for a response. And then it was the very last day of school when we was leaving, so we'd had all our T-shirts signed and we was all writing in the leavers books. And then Paul appeared at the door and he came over to me and Daisy and just handed us an envelope. And we was like, what's this? And he was like, I'm pleased to confirm that you got the job. Shauna's a whirlwind, so anybody who's met Shauna knows about it. She makes sure that you know about it. She makes sure that you know her name. Emotionally, she's so much more adult, so much more mature at 19, nearly 20. She'll kill me if I don't get her age right. Than when she first came, now she's a young woman who is a big part of the business, a big character within the business. I think from my point of view and from the business's point of view, whilst Shauna has learned an awful lot, we've learned a lot of her in terms of what it takes to employ a person straight out of school. 16 year olds, whilst they appear completely, totally confident, are often not that confident and, and have got some things that they need a little bit of help and guidance with. And yeah. I think that's one thing that we have been very, very good with, with the young people that have come into the business, is pairing them up with people within the business who can help them. Before I started Kenny's, I was in a bit of a bad place. Didn't know what I wanted to do work-wise, didn't know if I wanted to go to college. I wasn't really a positive person. I was very immature. Everything was like up in the air. I'd just lost my mum the year before, so it was very difficult for me to focus. I didn't even turn in the second day, actually. I had a bit of an argument with my, my dad, and rather than going to work, I went to school because I didn't know what to do, and I was panicking, and I was already late for work, and they was like, you can't do stuff like this. You can't act like a child. You need to go to work. You can't be losing this job. It was a small argument. She paid for me a taxi. And I got to work. My manager come downstairs and she sat me in this room and she said, you can't be doing things like that. If there's anything that you need to talk to me about, get off your chest. Just speak to me. You've got to move away from that now. They can't deal with you anymore. Like It's got to be us. At the time, I didn't like it. I, obviously, I was a nasty teenager. But when I think about it logically, like a month later, they was doing it for my own benefit and they wanted to see me progress. They said, like, you've got potential, we don't want you to waste it just because you're having a few bad days here and there. At the end of the day, it was the second day, so her not being in for the first two hours of the day is not going to shut the business down. But when you look into that and look into the background to it, I think that's more telling, that shows you what you're dealing with. So that was a wake-up call to me that we're going to have to do more than provide a bit of an education piece here. We're going to have to do more than just give somebody a job. What we do is we provide not just school leavers, but college leavers as well. We provide them with a, a platform to express themselves within a, a busy business and give them that earning potential at the age where they want it. I think Shona's valuable because she can be used as an example as to what's possible if you come into this business, dedicate yourself to it, show commitment, and you're prepared to progress yourself within the business. So she's a perfect example of that. I couldn't see myself ever working in another office or this is all I've known. I like the people, I like the managers, we have good bonds, good work ethic. We also talk and we also get to know each other and we do team bonding events and we're always doing fun things like this video now. I think me having a stable structure, getting up every morning, having a job, having the same schedule all the time, it's kept me 
kept me sane. I would like a more senior position because I feel like I know a lot, I do a lot. And for me to be up there, it would just make me feel proud. It'd like speak volumes to like other people in the business. Being an apprentice to then being a manager, it's like quite interesting to see where I will go. I recommend an apprenticeship because not all apprentices ask for qualifications. You might not have done well in school, you might have got D's. Ease, and then you go for your apprenticeship and they say well it's okay we can work on that do you know what I mean that makes you feel important that they're not just labeling you as oh they didn't go to school they didn't do really well so I thought I wasn't going to go nowhere and then I took an apprenticeship and here I am. Shauna's employment story is proof that an apprenticeship is a worthwhile option for any student it's a great chance to learn key skills gain qualifications earn a salary and build the initial foundations of a career and Shauna has achieved all of that whilst also becoming a highly valued member of our team, who is continuing to excel and grow in her role. And it's the success of people like her that really encouraged us as a business to launch our own social enterprise, Driving Change, which aims to replicate this story so more people can change their lives for the better. At the end of 2020, we achieved our goal of employing an additional 20 people through this scheme, with 17 of them coming from a challenging background. And this was just one of our first steps as we've now set a number of other targets that will completely reshape our entire organisation for the better. So if you'd like to know more about how we are breaking down the barriers to employment or how you could support more people like Shauna, please don't hesitate to get in touch.